Every single Reagan-esque ode to America, Obama said last night, was quickly followed by a but, but, but government is the answer. And we're going to have to invest billions of dollars. Yeah, yeah. No, I don't, no, I don't, I don't think. Yeah, we got to invest billions of dollars and grow the size of government, merge government, but it's really all about you and the entrepreneurial spirit of America. Yeah. It didn't work for me. We also heard about how great China is again and how we should, this is one of the first things that popped out of the screen, we should follow their lead on education and how they, quote, started educating their children earlier and longer. Oh, well, that's great. What could possibly, possibly go wrong with taking our kids away from mom and dad even more of the day and just putting them into the big government hands of the teachers' unions. No, seriously, that's going to be good. You watch, it's coming. Obama also said we should be more like South Korea, where teachers are known as nation builders. I don't want our soldiers known as nation builders. Why would I want our teachers known as nation builders? Here in America, he said, it's time we treated the people who educate our children with the same level of respect. I think when Joe Biden, he's looking over there, he's going, <laughs> don't we already do that? Do you know anybody who doesn't respect teachers? I actually feel bad for teachers. I mean, the good ones. We should fire the bad ones, which he wouldn't say last night. But the good ones get stuck working with the ones that we can't fire. I feel bad for them. I feel bad for them because they're actually working with a parent, with the kids, with parents don't, ever, don't even care. I don't know how they do it. But I have never, ever heard anyone say this. Oh, well, I'm just a teacher. Or, she's just a teacher. I haven't heard that. But I have heard, oh, well, she's just a mom. Or, the worst one, well, I'm, I'm just a mom. I hate that. I hate that. Maybe we should elevate moms and dads. Maybe the president needs to do a little more of this. This is him in the Oval Office. He's either sleeping or reading the plaque, like, who is that? Or just thinking about Abraham Lincoln. I think he should observe Abraham Lincoln. Abraham Lincoln said, everything I am, I owe my mother. Even President Obama knows this. I think that he would agree that he got an awful lot from his mother. His mother influenced him a great deal. And he wrote about it. He wrote a whole book about his dad in Dreams from My Father. So... Please don't tell me about more respect for the teachers. How about we elevate our parents?